red paint, steady hands, no malicious intent. I am an artist and I transcend through time and space and I have been here since the inception of his story and through ancient documentations of my creative pursuits, men have referred to me as a creator, a painter, or even a master sculptor. I'm not sure, however, what all these terms and definitions mean, but what is clear is that I am free. Free to live in the heart of every six-year-old with a spark of adventure and a desire to explore. Free to liberate my generation for what it's worth, giving them a sense of identity because they could use me to rewrite their history, literally. Free to communicate impressions made on the mind and translate these impressions into visual content. But what I'm saying here, if I'm saying anything at all, is that I think we should take a moment of silence as we lay to rest our fallen brother whose name is Ignorance. As we celebrate in a new era with intelligence, having respect for our fellow artisans, because from the cover of every child's storybook to the artistic impressions made on the pages of every history book to the biological charts that hang in every classroom wall, an artist had to create it. That means someone had to translate feelings, love, passion, emotion into visual storytelling, something that could not have otherwise be done by you. But no offense to you, as some of you are a doctor, a lawyer, a mechanic, or probably even a chef. So to say I could put paint to paper is the same as to say, let my 12-year-old daughter conduct your operations because you're dying from cancer. It's not the same thing. So stop saying it's just another painting because you're not just another human being that is just existing. You're a masterpiece. <laughs>